Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another cosplay video except I'm not in cosplay yet. I will be momentarily. Today is going to be an interesting and potentially dangerous video so you should better give me some views for that because in my hand over here I have a skateboard. I don't do anything that involves any form of mild risk. <laughs> And then I watched Skate the Infinity and I was like, skateboarding looks like heckin' fun because that's basically the message of skate. Skateboarding is fun. Uh, Langa can just jump on a board and he gets magic skateboarding abilities. So if I get into a Langa cosplay, can I then manifest the magic skateboarding abilities? I think this is a science video in that regard. So I have purchased a skateboard First, I'm going to attempt, the main thing I'm focusing on today is learning to stand on the board. I don't care, I'm not trying to actually be able to skate by the end of this. If I can stand on a board, then I consider this a success. Out of cosplay, ah. Why do the strangest things only happen when I am filming? <laughs> and a mosquito landed on my hand. Fun. I'm going to attempt to stand on this out of my longer cosplay, see how we go, and then put on my longer cosplay and see if there's any dramatic difference. Logically, I know there won't be. <laughs> so you see this pole over there? I'm gonna be attempting this right near the pole so I have something to grip onto. We do have a helmet somewhere and I should probably go look for it. I know I'm an idiot for not wearing protective stuff. I'm also not sure if this concrete is gonna aid me, be my friend or my worst enemy, because basically the gaps in the concrete, the wheels can kind of fit into, so that might help stabilize it, or it might make it worse. We'll soon see. Let's go. Ah! I'm gonna get attacked by mosquitoes. I think you put one foot like that, but I don't know which end's the tail and which end's the front. You just pick one. Okay, so I'm gonna plant it into this concrete here. Okay, one foot is easy. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna take my hand away from salt. There's a mosquito coming for my blood. Oh my gosh! Okay. Uh, without moving, I can stand on a skateboard. You can't see my face. <gasps> I stood on a skateboard. That shouldn't be as much of an achievement as it was, and yet it was. With the power of knowing, I can stand on this thing while holding on to something else for balance. I think it's time we get longer out and see how this changes. I'm thinking we do like a big dramatic like Shira transformation type thing, you know? Like you get the vibe. Let me demonstrate for you what I've seen. Liliana. Oh, I can't lift the skateboard up as a waterline there. For the honor of S. Well, that worked. Let's try and stand on a skateboard now. if you're just supposed to have both feet facing forward or one of them's facing this way and the other one's this way these are things i should probably look up to check i'm doing this right okay so it moves a lot but not in a way that you're gonna instantly fall off in the way that i expected didn't do that little intro thing ready i don't We've reached phase one. Hey. Okay, so new discovery if I actually wanted to start like doing the full skate thing. It wouldn't work very well with this concrete because it just stops it. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's starting to get scary. <laughs> Whee! 
I want to figure out how breaking works. Because I think, I always thought you just like, as you're going, you just put this foot down to make it stop. But I think it works that you have to like, do that. You know? Yeah, look at me. Expert pro skater right here. I, I stopped the skateboard. Pull me. You keep your front foot on. And I need my pole again. And then you use... I think you keep your foot where the screw's on. And then you take this one off. And then stay back on. So you do that, what I just did, but with momentum. <laughs> Which I don't have. <laughs> Do you like my little swimming arms? <laughs> this one needs to be coming back. I love this pole. I look like I'm hobbling. <laughs> look at me, I can step onto the board with some difficulty. Ugh. <laughs> oh, I sat too close. <laughs> you ready? This is some action shots for you. Whee! Into my recycling bin. Why don't professional skaters just do this? This is so much funner and less risky. No hands. <laughs> Are you impressed? That was a wobble. I start skateboarding for beginner skaters. If you're just getting started, there's some things you should practice. The first one is trying to pivot in a full circle. Practice both ways and really try to swing your hips around. This all looks scary as heck. So what do I do now? I can stand on it. I probably need to practice being able to stand on it. So we do just a little cha-cha slide on it. Uh, maybe I should see if I can actually get up some speed and do a proper little skateboard move. But that is really hard. With this concrete that stops you. Which I like that it stops me because it makes it less scary. But like... If I want to actually learn to do this, I need to I need to build up some speed. All right, let's go build up some speed. Wish me luck. Let's practice back back and stand. Wish me luck. Okay, this concrete actually is making this so much more difficult. But then if I actually want to learn to do this, where do I go to learn to do this? Because I don't want to do it on the road. Because then people can see me. And I don't want to go to a skate park. Because skate parks are terrifying. There's like 15 year old boys there. It's terrifying. I'm gonna go suss out another bit of concrete and see if it's any better, but I don't think it will be. The other... <sighs> Come, come down, come down here. This is an awkward angle, but I don't want to adjust the track log. The other concrete wasn't any better, because, uh, yeah, it was all downhill. I think I'm confident enough now to do an ollie. I mean, Langa did it pretty easy. Um, I'm sure I can too. Like, I can stand on a board now uh, without having to duct tape my feet to it. So let me show you the ollie that I can do. Are you ready, kids? You're about to be impressed. Ready, look. Huh? Whoa. Whoa. Just nailed my first ollie. Oops. So since I can do an ollie, I can really easily just go around in a circle too. Let me show you. Okay, ready, look. Whoa. 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 Ta-da. A full circle. So what I just discovered by being an idiot and going in a full circle is that I don't think I can actually get on a skateboard like I was just claiming that I could. <laughs> Cause I put it on a diagonal angle and so it couldn't get into the grooves of the concrete and I couldn't stand on it. It just keeps moving. So we're going back to the original goal of this, which is uh, 
learning to stand on a skateboard when it's not tucked into the grooves of the concrete. We're staying near the pole because pole is I'm gonna try out a couple more skateboarding things of me trying to stand on the board. <laughs> We're cool in this day. to do my proper full intro out here uh, so we might go duck down into a less neighbor invaded space so uh, I know my neighbors can probably still hear me in here but I feel safer in here <laughs> even though this is a really bad angle I am so so sorry but I have to film some TikToks as longer in a second so I don't want to mess up my whole setup so skateboarding huh it's real hard. I do you want to stick with this? I would like to genuinely be able to do some actual skateboarding stuff. Um, I'm not really interested in doing any of the big tricks or anything because they just look like terrifying. I expected to be able to do more with this video, um, but uh, skateboarding is hard and my neighbors were all out and I got embarrassed. I uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Uh, I really like being longer and this was quite fun to experience this uh, and so I do hope that you enjoyed if you did enjoy it, please give the video a like to help support the channel and then I know that this is kind of content that people like and this is the type of thing to make more of if you want to see more content from me you can subscribe to the channel so that you get to see all of my future content including more future cosplay content and if you want to watch more of my videos, you can stick around to the end screen to have more recommended to you. There are also going to be some longer TikToks on my TikTok, so you can go and check those out if you like. Thank you once again for watching, and that's all from me. I'll see you next time. Bye! Because they could hear me being like, <laughs> subscribe to my YouTube channel. Recky, my love of skateboarding comes from you. I'm so sorry to be editing this. Oh.